Did you know that right here on your street there's a migrant shelter? No. You had no idea? No. Really? No. Do you know that, that building right there is a shelter for migrants, the Stratford and Arms? No. The migrant shelter is literally right there, and then right next here is a school full of little kids that are all getting out of school right now. You're living here in New York City, and you're seeing what's happening with all these migrant shelters popping up everywhere. Why do you think they're keeping it such a secret? Well, because, I mean, you know, New Yorkers, you know, there's an old saying that it's better to beg for forgiveness than ask for permission. So in the situations, particularly nicer areas or more conservative areas like southern Brooklyn, when they have let people know they're going to, like, take a school and convert it, they face massive backlash, sometimes lawsuits, sometimes protests, sometimes just backlash. And it's much easier to just open one quietly and then later figure out how to deal with the pressure or it's much harder to close it once they're there and once it's open and once they're in place. So it's not surprising if you're trying to do something that may not be so legal or may not benefit your community, you know, it makes total sense 